Right. Without warning, a blood vessel can literally explode. And every year, 15,000 people die from an abdominal aortic aneurysm. It is a leading cause of death. And until now, the prevention and the treatment has been so severe for some people that they prefer to take the risk of sudden death instead. Medical reporter Christy Myers has the latest on a new and better choice. And she joins us now live from the newsroom. Christy? Gina, imagine if you were offered a 15-inch incision on your chest or a puncture in the leg. That's the difference between these two abdominal aortic aneurysm surgeries, yet not every hospital offers this new stent graft procedure. And patients who have an aortic aneurysm should be prepared to find out about it. And here's a picture of your aorta. Chuck Foster looks at his aneurysm with heart surgeon Got Ruth smaller. Bush. This big circle is the original aneurysm. This bulge in his aorta could have killed him within three we'll minutes. Abdominal aortic aneurysms, like so. Chuck's, can rupture with no warning signs. It was kind of like an option between life or death, really, because we never knew when it was going to explode. Even so, Chuck delayed taking action for a year because he didn't want the 10 to 15 inch incision of conventional abdominal aortic aneurysm surgery. They go home with a big incision in the abdomen, which would take anywhere between two to four months to heal completely. On the other hand, this new operation where we make a small incision in the groin, they go home the next day. Chuck was persuaded by a Houston VA medical team to try the new graft procedure. Now they just go stand it and you just well, everything is great. In November, the VA team uh, to took this stent and put it inside his stretched out artery. So that blood flow will come from above. It's then channeled within this tube. And aneurysm over time will get smaller and then shrink and will ultimately disappear. And that's already so happening for Chuck. Little... Since your original CAT scan, the aneurysm has gotten smaller and there's no blood flow. So we feel that the risk of any rupture or any danger to you from that aneurysm is very, very, very low. Unfortunately, this life-saving technology is not available in all hospitals. It's very important for a patient with aortic aneurysm to ask a physician for the different treatment options and that they can be evaluated for this new therapy. Now an easy ultrasound test can help you find out if you even have an abdominal aortic aneurysm because it can rupture without any symptoms. The Houston VA Medical Center has done more of this minimally invasive stent graft procedure than any VA hospital in the country. There are also half a dozen other Houston hospitals that offer this new aneurysm procedure too. All right, thank you, Christy.